Well, it was quite the surprise. Some boaters waking up to this this morning, a large houseboat on fire along the St. John's River at the Boat Tree Marina in Seminole County. That is right along the St. John's River where it meets Lake Monroe near Samford. Firefighters say no one was hurt, but as News 6's Clay Lepard explains, plenty of people realize the fire could have been a lot worse. Across the dock, Jewel Thompson couldn't believe what she was seeing. This houseboat that she happened to take a picture of yesterday during a beautiful sunset had become a ball of fire. So powerful, I could almost feel my face melting. For hours here at Boat Tree Marina, Thompson watched as the fire continued to spread throughout the boat, even burning up three pilings at the dock. And then the firefighters had to walk all the way down the dock. Until ultimately the boat sank. The manager of the marina showed us where boom netting surrounds the sunken boat to contain the gasoline inside the boat along with any other debris. No one appears to have been inside the houseboat when it caught fire. While the boat is gone, the manager along with many of the neighbors and other people who work here say weather was on their side because the wind was blowing away from the marina, which is not normal could have engulfed the whole marina. It was just really scary. It was so insane that like my parents were like freaking out because they thought it was going to blow over here and catch us on fire and like the dock and the whole marina could have been out. We're told the owner does have insurance and wasn't living in the boat full time. Crews are currently out working to get that boat out of the water sometime later this evening. In Seminole County, Clay Lepard, News 6.